Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tyler Lost and I was gonna talk to y'all more about what's been happening and um there's a lot of things that it needs to be addressed with and um yeah um remember I remember I told y'all um yesterday about the whole threat you know about the whole death threat situation that's going on towards the rock and woman range of course well it's it's getting worse because now they because now they receive a death threat towards Eva but Eva my bad um, in case you don't know, she's, um, the NXT general manager and also The Rock's daughter. And when I saw this on Twitter, you know, one of my, uh, one of my friends, um, as he posts this, I, I don't know what to say. And it made me sick to my stomach. And that's just like, take, like, that's just gone beyond farther, uh, further of, of what's been going on in this pro wrestling community. I mean, not just any pro wrestling community, but this entire thing. I get it that y'all want Cody Rose versus Roman Reigns, but that's took beyond too far. And it's really not that serious. It, it really don't. It's really not that serious because I get it that y'all don't want Roman, you know, The Rock versus Roman Reigns. At WrestleMania, I get it, but y'all better than this. Like, wherever some, wherever some toxic fans out there that are making death threats towards wrestlers or celebrities, they could probably sue you. If that ever happens, and because it's it's always happens to some other people that does that shit, and I get it that you don't like some other you know some other wrestlers like like CM Punk, Kenny Omega, or anybody, but you don't have to take it that too further than that. Like, you don't. And that just made me sick to my stomach of, of seeing this. Like, y'all take this way too serious. And y'all go way beyond your heads because of, of what? Because y'all don't want to go your ways? Oh, seeing the matches of course I mean I heard on the comments I, I heard on the comments the same thing that happens on the AEW that being so toxic towards Brian Danielson's they're making death threats towards Brian Danielson and his daughter as well the same thing that happens like what the fuck is wrong with y'all like, what is this? For me, I just always be patient, you know. And, you know, I go follow them ways and stuff like that. But that's just, like, too much of what is going on in, in this, like, in this social media. Like... I, I, I just don't understand. 
But then, um, Eva, uh, Ava decided to like, you know, deactivate, you know, her account, her um, Twitter account, cause um, cause of the whole harassment and stuff, you know, and like death threats and stuff. I mean, I mean, what the. F I mean, what the fuck is wrong with y'all? Like, like, what is going on? I mean, it's not just a Cody's fan. It's a lot of them. Like, almost every Toxic fan that has something to do with it. I mean, she had nothing to do of The Rock versus Roman Reigns. Does she book it? No. She only happens at the... At the NXT. And y'all and y'all out here making threats towards families. I I don't believe this. I I don't fucking believe this. So shout out to um to King of the Ross, you know, um he actually made a video he made he actually made a uh, talk about these, and, um, he actually a post about it since the last time, but, um, I thought, you know, if I wanted to post, and here, here what they, here what the post says, um, it's for, um, Eva. And it says, can y'all leave, can y'all just leave me out of this? I'm busy running a show. And she's talking about NXT. She ran the show. And, and here's the other ones. Here's the other one. Death threats over a situation I had nothing to do with. Do with. Be for real. Like, I just don't understand. Like, it's, it is really not that deep, man, like, I, I just don't understand, like, what is going on, like, all this discussing behaviors and, what the fuck is wrong with these people, like, that's that's just too much, man. And this is the same thing that happened since yesterday. Said I hope the Rock get fucking killed, and I hope and I hope Roman Reigns get fucking the Kenya. What the fuck are y'all are y'all serious right now? Are y'all like seriously? Like, what is, what is going on in this world? Like, y'all want to plan on a riot towards WWE. Like, are y'all serious? Like, come on, man. Y'all know better than that. That's what, that's what made me upset about this. Because I was a pro wrestling fan. And I always knows that, um, that I understand about, you know, from business and stuff. Because when I always fall along with the storyline, one is the best or one is the worst. And I, I understand how this whole, you know, this whole rating thing, so, you know, making money and every single time because... It's all, it, I mean, it's all about respect. And you gotta be respectful towards wrestlers. Including myself, I always, I always respect everybody. Because I always follow along the rules. And you know, except Drew McIntyre, he's a piece of shit. 
But um, anyways, um, I just don't understand why so many people that take it very seriously of what is like of what is happening in WWE. Like, I I understand that y'all ain't on the Rock, but not not his family. Like. That's just like messed up how this happens towards wrestlers and that's just like like make me upset and it's it's too much it's too much going on man like I I just don't understand man like what is going on? Like, I, I I don't know, but I it's gotta stop, man. Y'all needs to stop, cause all of this it's it just it just get out of line. Like, I, I I don't know what to say. I really don't know what to say, bro. Like, yeah. I mean, that's the that's the only that's the only problem that is going on in this like. And just airing that because I I don't know man it's all it's all about you know trying to protect ourselves against bullies and trolls and everything because I feel like they doing this because I don't know I I just really don't know man. Like, it just, like, it's just making me upset about this. And I just wish it would stop. I mean, it's, tw it's 2024, and I just didn't want this happen to this, like, too early drama and stuff, because... I don't know. It's it's really too much. <sighs> Look, this is go for all y'all. It's okay to be upset. But don't, but not too much seriously. I mean, if you don't like it, that's fine. Just don't watch it at all. Don't make a, don't make a video about it. Don't comment about, you know, threatening every single time because, like, you can't like enjoy the good match or something, and that's okay. But all this threatening stuff is going complete too far. Just enjoy life. Just go outside. It just get a therapy or something. I mean, I know I, I would get therapy as well because you know I have mental illness and stuff. But that's besides the point. Like, whatever, whatever it is, just go to therapy, man. Like, I don't know what's been going on, but it's, it's too much to handle. Like, for me, I, I always, like, you know, when I finish up my, um, YouTube every single time, 
I just, you know, play video games, you know, I try my best to talk to my girl. I mean, I hope I don't get broke up or dumped. I don't know. And, you know, I mean, I will try my best to talk to my family as well because even though I would try, I would do it as well. Cause I'm, I mean, I'm not, I don't want to be the silent person anymore <laughs> because um, I just, you know, I just only talk every single time. And, you know, it's how I, it's how I do. But sometimes I've been dealing with I've been dealing with everything that's going on and this issues in you know, my own family and stuff so but it'll pass through on so yeah but um but also I will go outside as well and you know have some fun because it actually helps me it actually helps me you know if my if my mom would have take me outside every single day, and and you know I want to do something new like like I want to go to acting school and you know learn how to do some acting and stuff and you know do some martial arts cause I need some you know flexibility some strength and all that because. Um, I want to learn a lot of my story every single day, so, yeah. And, you know, i do anything I wanted to, like, um, to help me, you know, get my mental illness straight. And protect, protect myself throughout bullies and trolls and stuff like that, because, like, all this, you just got to to, like, let it let it go okay just let it go I mean if it's still if Cody Rose versus Roman still happen it could happen because I heard it happens at the press conference and I'm old and willingly to hear about it because I want to see what it happens so yeah so y'all got to learn how to be patient and just relax Otherwise, I don't know, man. I don't know what we're going to talk you out of it, man. But, um, I don't know what to say, man. I'm just upset about what's been going on, and it's just too much. Like, I can't have, like, a, I can't have, I cannot have a good day of this happens, and, it really, it really upsets me, like, I don't know, like, yeah, it's just, it's just too much, man, it's, it's too much going on, and I just hope it'll stop, I don't know, but, um, I mean, I don't know if I'm gonna take a break from this because I'm I'm trying to figure out what the hell is going on, and it just makes me sick to my stomach, and I don't know, but um, I I, I just don't know, man, but um. But make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and here. click the bell notification down below. I don't know. I'll see y'all next time. Bye. Fuck is wrong with these people, man?